Hello, Dull Bed Sit Blogger here, and uh, I'm going to do another Grump Skull Chronicle into Candy. Yes, one in two days. Well, you see, I've remembered where I hid, in the, I hid the box with them all in. And today, in this lovely uh, summer's October evening, I'm going to do the Violet Crumble, which uh, looks quite interesting. I'm imagining something kind of along the lines of a crunch and palm of violets I don't know uh, the Nestle 50 gram violet crumble there you go oh yeah I'm gonna try and do this without any edits as well because I'm very lazy uh, it's the way it shatters that matters it's the way it shatters that matters I think they should have William Shatner doing a uh, uh, an advert for this saying uh, it's the way it shatters it matters uh, that'd be good so uh, Nestle oh no Nestle they're an evil corporation aren't they they won't take my idea and give me some money they'll just take it and then they'll steal stuff from my bedsit damn you Nestle evil corporation anyway let's get on with the trying shall we um, the post office have shattered it a bit but you know it's tricky oh, right, so let's see so uh, oh it's got a very tight bubble on the honeycomb in the middle Now it's not nearly as violety as I was imagining. I was imagining a bit of a flowered, scented flavour to it. Oh yeah, there is a little hint of violetiness. Let's, let's have a let's have the ingredients. Um, has it got? See, what? Why? Why is it a violet crumble? I can't taste any violet flavour in it. Basically, very similar to a crunchy, kind of a, a bit of a, a thicker, heavier uh, honeycomb in there. But basically, it's a crunchy. I was expecting a bit more palm of violet flavour. So, um, because this is a no edit one, I'm going to do a very sneaky thing so I can turn off the uh, thing and not have to snip it in in editing. So I'm going to do a nice crunch, nice and close, so you can hear the crunchiness and hear me chewing it. Okay, so you're ready. So this is what it looks like. Mmm. Bye bye.